We ordered this a little while back, finally came in. Uh, we're gonna pop this open. We're paying mad bread for this apartment, so we might as well try to get some money back out of it. So we got a little poster to promote Cove Care. Bye. Let's see the reaction of that, bro. Let's see what the people have to say. Yo, making money requires sacrifices, bro. I'm sacrificing my sunlight to make bread. <laughs> I'm not even a baker. This shit cost us $119. It's $1,190 in sales. If we get that back, we made our money back. Everything on top of that is just Step one, start a business. Step two, get posted. Step three, profit. If anybody's interested in some advertising space, we're selling these for 3K a month. Everybody who's crossing the Brooklyn Bridge gets a view. Whatever you want. I'll sacrifice my sunlight for 3K a month. It's actually it's pretty fire. It's not like blocking out a lot. Yeah, it's not bad. I feel like I need some masks. I mean, if you do, you, you should visit covecares.com. Should I use code BK as well? Yeah, for sure. It's pretty nice. I mean, it's not like a sports car, but 60 bucks. You should get it like a sports car. I should, bro, it's I definitely not that much. I didn't care about the money. I told him I'll pay whatever I need to pay, but whatever it's my first car, my rookie car, maybe my uh, next car will be. What do you think the value of these cars is? You know, it depends how you perform. If you weren't to finally stop selling doji, you know, it could be a it could bro, two X quick. So stupid. So so stupid. Bro, I put in not put in five K. It's almost thirty now. Can you imagine I put like real, I mean, I would never put real money into doji, so I don't I don't feel regret. I'm just saying like that's... Well, you only put in money because I told you in Tulum. I mean, that's true. No, you guys were just like on the hype train, like always, so I'm like, okay. No hype train, bro. At that time, I believed it. <laughs> when it started no, you just knew that uh, that's when Robinhood stopped, halted trading for GameStop. Yes. And you were like, oh, the, oh, the gen degenerates are gonna go buy some doji. Yeah, exactly. So. Sick, no, this is my official call right here. It's one. Two. Oh, that is fucking beautiful. By the way, guys, just so you know, this background, a little fans, it's not Photoshop. It's not. It's real. It's a pretty cool background. It's pretty sick. What is this, Orlando, Orlando Magic Stadium? incorporating in luminance data and grayscale image. Um, that's just a combination. This is filtered. This is height contrast. So this is something that a 2D camera wouldn't be able to do because it can actually see the deviations in height. So if your card is going like this, there's even scratches and anything along those lines. Now you have a great card in under a minute. Mm -hmm. That's the whole that's yeah, the whole process. Yeah. You're if, yeah. If, you will, if you create a system right here that we're talking about and that could be a million, that's a million dollar company over there. Or so. what, are, what are we doing over here? Working. What are we working on? Turning Pokemon cards into cash. It's one of your many businesses. I never showed this in my videos, my nine chars are. Send it since PWCC. They give you 1% of up loans. <laughs> Good. 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 You think I could send it in Whoa. just like this? Wait, you have. Oh, wow. You think I could send it in just like this? Wait, check this out. What are you sending in? No, of course not. You don't think so? Only $100,000 in my guess. What's better, a strong BGS9 or a PSA9? Here's the fire. Why are you, yo? Classic card. Yo guys, look. Oh, that's, 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 that's the this heat. This is a brown boxing checklist. 7,500. 142. 7,500. You don't want this. You don't appreciate Russell Wilson. Um, I thought you were giving this me like, this one. So you really need to replace all these? Yeah. 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 
see what the boys are doing. Can you stop talking and give us a fucking bonus? Bro, I just got here. I'm already down? You're already down to Yeah, we're going big or going home at 10 bets. Yo, Carlos, we're losing money fast, bro. Quickly, come on. Enjoy while it lasts. About 4,000. Bro, come on. I didn't even like get warmed up yet. Bro, come on. So my boys got involved in a pyramid scheme. Bro, but you can't cash out. <laughs> no jet. When it goes to exchange, it's gonna be ten times more. And we got cash out. Yeah, but you know what I got? Uh, where the real money is. Well, Carlos, I don't know why you decided this is a good idea. Carlos, why did you drag me into this? <laughs> so, uh, all, all or nothing. Carlos, what are the times? Monday? So your guy... Oh, that's personal information. Yo, you can't look at that. It's sensitive. It is? Let me see. Let me see. So how did you meet Master P? We do a lot of sponsorships. So we ended up sponsoring this one basketball tournament. His manager, like his right-hand man, Juggy, was at that tournament, apparently. Um, liked the uniform that the kids were wearing. I'm assuming, asked somebody, where'd you get them from? And then just called us. It was like a Saturday. It was like a Saturday morning. Me and Alex are at the office. Alex picks up um, and he's like, hey, like, um, I'm here with Master P. He wants to talk to you about getting uniforms for his basketball tournament. Alex was like, what? Master who? He's like, yeah, Master P. I'm gonna give him the phone right now. Give him the phone and that's it. In the beginning, it was like, I think you like 30 jerseys. He was just running a basketball tournament. So we did that, but then, you know, just kept in touch and then the relationship just got stronger. We visited a bunch of times in LA. After like a few years, he's like, hey, I'm starting this brand. I'm starting this clothing brand, Medusa. And, you know, I need help with it. And then we just kind of took charge and did all the designing, set up the website, set up the ads, um, set up all the marketing effort, did the production, samples, all of that. And yeah, it was Medusa at first. And then a few years later, he pivoted to Magnati. And then the relationship just evolved to the point where he wanted to launch an apparel line and Yeah, you know. I could tell you the story. Alex came to me one day in the morning and said I need you to do this favor for me. And then he said, I have Master P on the line and we need to we, we need him to approve this brand. So I said, okay, I do it. I did ten designs. The relationship built because he showed Master P and Master P was like impressed, was very inspiring to see him wear my stuff on everywhere, everywhere. Like, yeah, he wears, he wears it every day, that's the only thing Yeah, he but, 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 but that Medusa started a movement, you know? When he wore that hoodie on, on, the, bref on, the, on the breakfast bref club? The breakfast club, it was like, he was the only one with that design. And Charlemagne... Asked him, what is that? Yeah, right. like, comment that that, hot. Yeah, like, <laughs> and when I saw it, I was like, wow, like, like I, all the Charlemagne, Angel, Lee was commenting on the jacket, you know? But really, it really was very, and then he was at Sway in the morning, and he was on the other couple of stuff. He was on everywhere with it, and it just blew up from there, you know? It just really blew up from there, and it was very, like, I felt like I made it during that time, you know? Go to hoodies, and then in effect, yeah, go to hoodies, this one. This one? This is yeah. our best seller? Is that best seller? Did they um, put like all the revenue numbers on AdWords in the dashboard? On, like on the AdWords dashboard, can you see? Yeah, on Facebook. On Facebook you could see that. On Facebook? Because you put the pixel, right? Yeah. The most powerful thing on Facebook is the lookalike. Yeah, the lookalike. That's the most amazing thing. You literally can take your customer base or your followers, you upload them, and now Facebook just finds everyone finds just everybody, like them. Yeah. Everyone just like them, you can just target. it. You could spend fifty thousand dollars on Facebook and just earn one thousand. You bought me a four thousand dollar man, a four thousand dollar laptop, and you're spoiled. <laughs> <laughs> we buy you a four thousand dollar Mac, Master. He's buying you a four thousand dollar Mac. Bought, so it, like he's it, it, um, a counter card, and I'm like, oh wow, it, it's serious. It's a counter card, and said whatever computer you want. So I chose the modest MacBook Pro. I chose the entry level MacBook Pro. And the guy went on Amazon and chose the Mac Store one. So I'm like, um, do you want this one? I was like shocked. I said, I did, I, did, I wanted to say no, 
But I said, I mean, yeah, that's fine in a humble way. And then, and then he ordered it, and then in two days I got it. And I was like, damn, you know. But that was a real, real thing he did for me, you know. I feel that people, they hate on it too much. I had to, to really people like random people. And Who gives a fuck about random people? I know, you're right. But what the fuck are they doing? Yeah, are exactly. Are they doing some shit? Yeah, they're not. They're not doing anything. So I had to really, I, I had to really sit down and um, moderate. I, 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 I run the man, um, money at the um, Instagram, and I've been looking at these people hating like, uh, like for no reason. I'm like, what is their problem, bro? Come on, bro. You like, get, you, you'll get used to that. Yes. Yeah. So I had to really look at this and say, eating on a guy that's successful and doing everything he can to bring his brand across. What are you doing? What, what, what are you people doing? This guy was arrested on for months. Like from 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 2018, he was arrested for trash, 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 trash. And I'm like, what's the problem? From? When I see that, I just like it's so foreign to me. Yeah. Because I'm like, I don't know what has to be going on in my life. For me to be scrolling on Instagram, yeah. seeing something I don't like, yeah. and being compelled to go and write trash, trash, trash. Like, like there are plenty of things I see that I don't like. I just, I keep it moving. I wrote the shit. Yeah. Alright. Go get this one. Get an emergency haircut. Find an emergency. Turn around for a second. We're dipping tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. We don't buy tickets in advance, bro. Buy tickets for tonight, tonight for 8 a.m. tomorrow. I don't think we've ever went on a trip that was planned for more than two days. I never get a return flight. It's the biggest mistake you can make. Heard it here first.